I'm the map, I'm the map, I'm the map, I'm the map, I'm the map. Hello everybody, I am Crazy Lewis and welcome on here to a brand new video here on my YouTube channel. Hope you guys are having a great day today and maybe this video might make your day even better because I have got something to show you guys. I've been wanting to show you this for quite a while now, don't have the time to do so, but I thought today was a good day. I've opened up the tripod, I'm trying out this new layout and I'm going to be taking a look at whatever is in this lovely, lovely cylinder box. And I know exactly what is in this. I got this for Christmas and I think it is amazing guys. I really do. I think this is probably a traveller's best gift. So if you want to know what this is, this is a scratch off where you've been map. So it's a worldwide map and you can scratch off where you've been. Let me read the description here. <coughs> they say a journey of a thousand miles must begin with a single step. We say it begins with a single scratch. Who wrote this? A cat? Alright. Scratch map is a large, high quality wall map which features a gold top foil layer. Why? So you can scratch off all the places you visited to reveal a whole new world below. A whole new world. A whole new perfect point of view. Featuring a vibrant colour and geographical detail, the result is a totally unique and personalised world map. What a perfect gift for the intrepid traveller in your life. Or yourself, like for me. So, uh, it says the exact same thing at the bottom, but this is an amazing map. I really do want to show you what it is like. So why don't we begin scratching at it, shall we? And I'll show you exactly what you have to do and no, you don't do this because you accidentally hit yourself what, 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 baseball nah so just want to make sure everybody here knows this video is not sponsored by the scratch the world map but you can follow the link in the description below to get it yourself and you can scratch off everything like where you've been and take a photo show me it on social media and I would like to know every country you guys have visited. So, if, you, if Scratch World Map does want to sponsor me, go ahead and send me an email, but let's begin scratching. So I've not opened this map in over a month now, Christmas Day was the last time I opened up, so it's sprung right out, I've had to actually hold it with cups, because it's just going to keep on folding back over. I've not got a frame for it yet, but I am going to be framing this in my room, and I'll basically show everyone who comes over everywhere I've been, so it's pretty cool. Let me show you everywhere I've been so far. This is the cool thing about them, so you scratch out everywhere you've been, and it's actually incredible. Cape Verde, England, Italy, Portugal we just done last year. Poland, I've been there for a day, do need to go back. There's Spain, been multiple times to Spain. Turkey's hiding, and so there's the USA, and there's the United Kingdom. So get a scratch of these parts. So there's Spain, Italy, Poland. 2020 going to London soon so that'll be epic Turkey there's Florida right there and then the big one right there 2020 going to Canada so one thing that has really annoyed me with this map there's only one particular thing it has and that is so it's got England I've been to England so I've marked it down it's got Ireland I'm going to be marking it down today it's got Wales, I've never been to Wales, and then it has got Britain, the United Kingdom. But where is Scotland? Okay, yes I live there, so that technically does mean I have your I spent most of my time here. So I'd love to have the Scottish flag on here, but where is it? Why has it got the British flag, the English flag, the Welsh flag and the Irish flag if it does not have Scotland on it? 
he should not compromise. It should either be England, Ireland, well Ireland will be there, but it should either be England, Wales and Scotland. Or it should just be Britain and have England and Wales off. It's only that is the only concern. But apart from that, I do love this map. So along with the map, I got some particular things in this nice like sunglasses case. So everything you need is in here. So let me show you. So you get a nice magnifying ruler. Just to help because there's a lot of countries that can be very small, lots of writing. If you do find it difficult to find all the writing, that magnifying glass is epic. We also have this, this is our main tool, this is our scratcher. So of course you scratch all the gold off, reveal your whole new design. You get stickers. Let's just say you went on some adventure holidays. Let's just say you went to the Alps and you went skiing. You can get a skiing sticker, take it off, stick it to the Alps. Voila, shows people what you've done. And then last but not least you've got this golden pen, that's why I wrote the 2020 on this. This is a good pen because it can actually rub off on this thing. So when I have been to Canada, when I've been to London, those 2020 I'll rub off with just an eraser like that. And voila, shows I've been there. And if there's one more thing I can feel in this bag, should be from guitars I think. It probably is just a guitar pick. But this is really good if you need to get right down and dirty with this and get all the little scratch bits away. This is actually so perfect, like you get colouring ones but I'm not very good at colouring and I don't really have the patience for that so getting a scratch one which just boom, scratch it off and it's an easy way to remember where you've been. If you've been travelling loads and loads and loads this is definitely the best thing for you. So there is two particular things I'm going to be scratching here today as an example for you guys. So I'm going to put the scratch down on Hungary, say this I've been to Budapest. And I'm going to put the scratch down for Ireland, say this I visited Dublin a few weeks ago. Once I've added them on, I'll count up how many countries I've been to and show you how many places I've been in my whole 18 years of life. Which I should be entirely grateful for because it is a lot of countries. I am so impressed, but I can't wait to add more on the list in this decade. But anyways, let's get started. So firstly, there's Hungary right there, Budapest. So as you see, Budapest is very small, so I can't just score off like a little bit of Budapest. I'm going to put the whole of Hungary, because I have now been to Hungary. So let's do this. So there you go, there's Hungary done. I've done a little bit of Slovakia by accident, but it's looking good. I'm a lot better with doing the actual flags. It's the flags I think are cool, but at least that shows you I've been to Hungary. Hopefully I'll be able to add a little bit of Romania now because I've now scratched a little bit off. Same with a little bit of Austria, same with a little bit of Slovakia. Just means I'm gonna to have to go visit those places. Now the next one we're gonna be scratching off is Ireland. We're not going to scratch off the Northern Ireland because it's actually got it squared off. So let's just do it. There's Ireland right there, nicely done. I also forgot to show that you also get this nice like glasses wipe. So you can wipe down all your little scratch marks. Just neaten it up a bit. So next on my list is going to be the flags. The flags are the coolest bit about this. So I can't wait to have every single flag here, unfortunately, but Scotland. <laughs> but there's so many flags, so many places I'm probably not going to get to anytime soon. But I can now add an extra two. So let's do that right now. Thank you. 
And there we go. That is all the flags up to date on my Scratch a World map. Can't wait to add more to this list. So currently I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So there we go, 12 countries in 18 years. That is not too bad at all. It's quite a lot to be honest. I can't wait to add a lot more to this list. So there you guys go. I have now scratched and kept up to date on this Scratch a World map. Hope you did enjoy this fun new video. If you did guys please smash the like button, share with all your family and your friends, subscribe to never miss me explore all of these places and even go to some of the ones I've already scratched off again. There's a lot of places, Ireland in particular, Italy, definitely, or Poland I need to do more. A lot of these places I am really want to explore more and more and more. So stay tuned, subscribe, click the notification button to never miss me. Go to any of these places as I'm going to be marking off another, at least one in this, um, this year. Maybe even two, hopefully two. And also, drop a comment in the comment section will tell me what your favourite flag is. I would probably say mine. It's probably the Scottish flag just because I'm a quite a patriotic William Wallace dude. But... If I had to pick not my own, I'd probably say Brazil, probably is my favourite flag, or Canada. Brazil is good because, you know, it just looks fun, very positive. And Canada, you know, it just makes me think of maple syrup, which, who doesn't want to be thinking of maple syrup at any time of the day? And, check out the description for all my social media links this as well, and I will have a link to where you can buy this map, maybe you want one yourself. And when you do, maybe you're going to do what I'm going to do, which is going to be frame it, put it up on a wall, and it will basically be my own personalised custom map. So that is pretty epic, if I do say so myself. And anyways, there you go guys, I will see you all in the next video. Crazy time out. Have fun scratching guys. Bye bye.